Hey YouTube, this is Scarecrow Kaiser. Um, I'm going to do a uh, sort of delayed uh, deck profile here. Um, this is my um, uh, current like Kagro build, uh, post set 11. Um, could have done this like a week ago. I've been like too busy. Um, since like set 11 came out like a week ago, I've played in three tournaments with this deck. Uh, first one like. I went. I, I ended up getting like fifth place because I lost to like someone who hit like every trigger in the book, um, and then uh, later on I ended up losing again for making putting me in fifth place um, to someone who two to pass me. So, but since then I've played two other tournaments and went undefeated in both. So uh, it's working pretty well. I like it a lot. Um, Kygro is my favorite clan, as you guys have probably noticed, uh, it's the deck. I have a lot of very competitive, um, performances with, so. Uh, starting Vanguard, Conro. Um, I doubt anytime soon I will ever stop using him as a starter for Kygro. He's pretty amazing. I don't think any of us can argue that. Uh, Triggers. 7 crits, 5 draw, 4 heal, grade 1s, 4 bar, 4 sealed dragon perfect guards, um, 3 of this guy, uh, what's his name, Kersey, uh, 3 heat nail salamander, uh, grade 2s, um, 4 of the sealed dragon 10k beater, and then 3 more beaters, uh, Four corduroy, um, four dauntless drive dragon, the break ride. It's pretty good. I really like this card. And then four dragonic overlord, the end. Um, so it's kind of like this deck is trying to take the advantage of the break ride, doe, and the sealed dragon corduroy, basically all at the same time right here. Um. Yeah, so because of the break ride, um, that's why I have the uh, 5 draw, 7 crit. Um, in my normal dote decks, I like to run 6 draw. However, um, in this deck, uh, I like to have a little more push power to push my opponent into a corner using the crits. Especially when um, off the break ride, I restand my vanguard and he's standing up with a crit. That's pretty good. Um, so I like the extra power to push back, as well as the uh, 10k power shield that the crits can have over the draw, because I like having like solid defenses when I have to discard a like to restand. I like having like that high shield in hand. However, also on that same note, I like the extra draw power that helps you. Um, like discarding a draw is obviously like optimal when it comes to using the break ride restand skill as well as more draws help you get to your other dotes so that you can be live off the persona blast <clears throat> and then when we talk about corduroy here basically there's all these steel dragon triggers grade ones 10k beaters they're mostly for this card right here corduroy corduroy is a really good card for one is special counter blast you get to retire an opponent's rear guard and then they can look at their top four, and if they get a great two, they can call it. If they don't get a great two, they call it nothing. So Kagro does what it's good at, um, and what it's best at doing, which is killing grade ones. So I am always using my corduroys to kill their grade ones, and if they get the grade two off of uh, to replace it, that's fine. I'd rather you have a grade two than a grade one. It's harder to replace a grade one than it is to replace a grade two. Um, because a grade 2 and a grade 3, you have those, and, yeah, I'd rather you just have that, and two grade 2s in the same column, obviously, is less impressive than a grade 2 and a grade 1. Um, plus, like, I would say probably, like, almost 50% of the time, when I use him, they just don't get anything off the top, so it was just counter blast 1 for a plus 1, which, obviously, I don't think anyone can argue that is bad, that's pretty damn good. And then teamed up with the heat nail, um, these two together 
are applying the pressure and eliminating those grade ones so that I don't have to guard as much against your attacks if you run out of grade if you run out of like good boosters and stuff, which is often very relevant for when I'm discarding my three to restand. I'm depleting my shields a little bit. So when you don't have the booster, um, it kind of takes a little bit of the load off me to have to survive to my next turn. <clears throat> yeah, but as I said, uh, two out of three tournaments undefeated with it. Um, it's running well. I really enjoy it. Um, I'll try to get some other deck profiles from Set 11 coming soon. Um, like a s pure Seal Dragon deck and... Tachis and stuff, so thank you for watching.